Paris. They are very distant, yeah. This is a blessing in disguise, you know? Yeah. Because mm -hmm. I feel like you two, you haven't been coupled up for a long time now. Yeah. And it's going to go in your favour. Mm, but how, how do you feel about it? Like, it doesn't affect me in terms of, like, like I don't care about people's opinions. Mm -hmm. And I think the Casa boys, you know, they definitely showed me what I was missing and what the public was seeing. I think it's more like I didn't expect me and you to be chosen over Casey and Claudia. Obviously, Claudia's come in, her and Casey have clicked straight away and they do have a special connection. Yeah. But to say that someone's compatible after two days compared to two weeks, you can't compare them. It's probably not. It's probably nothing to do with that. Mm. I feel like I'm probably one of the least favourites in it. Why did you say that? They've been put on free three times. Yeah, but that's yeah. So maybe, maybe it's me. I forgot his name. Sorry. At least like you haven't you haven't let it like affect you. Do you know what I mean? Remember, even though you've been in the bottom three three times, yeah. there's a reason you've been saved. No, I know that. Because everyone in here loves. It's very telling. It's very telling. Can't say I'm shot. Sure. Missing me already. Clearly not enough. He's lost my game. All his words were lies. Dive right in. Then we played beer pong and there was things written on the bottom and unfortunately I'd been there like a day yeah. and I got given that and I literally was like, are we joking? Like, are we joking? Like, I don't want to answer that. I didn't have anyone to pick. I literally, I wanted to pick Ron. So I picked him, but I knew he'd take it in sort of a light-hearted way. And then the boys were like, you haven't got to pick two boys. And I thought, oh, actually, yeah, I guess I could pick a girl. And I thought, maybe if I pick a girl, it'll make the Ron thing stand out more. Yeah. And I was looking at them, I was like, you guys know this is not personal. And like, because I knew briefly, like I'd met Liv before in yeah. a work setting. I, and she was looking at me like, girl, yeah. I don't know why, I just thought, baby girl, you know this is not serious. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. You. And oh my god, did that backfire. <laughs> and I said to her as soon as I was like, are you okay? Like, you know this is not personal. Yeah. Like, we, we had no issues before. We've always crossed paths like in, in work and stuff like that, and it's been good vibes. So when she took, like, she really took offense to it. And it seemed like as soon as I showed interest in Tom and it was reciprocated, she suddenly mm. had this unfinished business. It was just her having picking problems, if you want me to be honest, coming to me with more problems. And I was just like, what is going on? Like, these things I wouldn't even care about. Um, just, I felt like in the end, like, if she was just watching how I'm moving all the time, like, why are you so concerned? I would never care like what anyone else is doing. There'd be points in the villa where some of the boys would come up to me and be like, oh, question how if she's playing again, well, she's not as genuine with the boys because as soon as Harris left, she was up and down with like the different guys.